and I bent down and I touched the soil of America, the arid, blasted, sun-charred soil that was given to Abe's parents. It's Indian country, reservation. It's yours, so you stay there, in hate for the worst land. You can't go on seeing the land like this day in, day out, missing her beauty, the way she is, just because she was once the garbage can shaped by government treaties. You can't go on seeing the land castrated, sad, just because they left her to you as a prison, a way of keeping you out of the fertile land where the farms are white and Jesus prospers. But poor Abe stood there, lashing out at me, threatening fire and brimstone and hell from a medieval world. He stood there like a plant grown from the old roots of the land when she was made a reservation. And all the sadness ended in his frame, his burning eyes. But he doesn't know what he comes from and has nothing to forgive and let go. So I walked towards him with no hurt anymore in my face. I sensed some pity but a strength of vast depths in my bones coming at him and I took the matches and handed them to him.